it? Yes. <laughs> okay. Uh, last week we discussed about the basic elements of a map. Do you remember that? Yeah. Can you someone uh, tell me about the uh, the basic elements of a map? Direction. Yeah, direction. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, direction and scale. Uh, and you should have a, a legend, a key. A key. Very yeah. good. Yes. Another one. Yes, the title. So that we need to know those things. Okay. Today we are just going to take a scale out of those basic elements so that we are going to discuss about the scale. So uh, with me here, I have put the meaning of the word scale. Uh, scale it is a ratio between the measurement on a map and a corresponding measurement uh, of the earth. Yeah, um, let's see, what, what did it mean here that uh, we have the map, uh, as I have this, I have this comma. So this map, I think we need to know the distance from one place to another, but uh, this is the distance on the map. But uh, this map is representing an actual cloud. So we need to know what's the distance from one place to another on the cloud. So we use it scale. Are we together? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so uh, there are three ways in which scale is represented on a map. The first one is a statement scale. Kilometers. 
Uh, but on the map here, it can be like a small area. So that one is called the bar scale. Are you together? Are you following? Yeah. And the last one is a representative uh, fraction. Fraction? Fraction in mathematics? Ratio. You learn it, yeah, ratio. You learn in mathematics about ratio? Yeah, so you, you represent it, you like uh, it. Yeah, so it means one unit represented 50 units. So if you have a, your ruler, uh, on the, on, on, you take your ruler and you come on the map, and you find that from here to here, it's uh, two units. So, but one unit is representing what? So if here is two units, it means that distance is 100 kilometers. So these are the three ways in which we use, uh, the scale is used to represent uh, the distance of the map and the distance of the actual ground. So I'm going to share you this map. Uh, can we, uh, with a representative fraction? Yes. Um, we add ratio to a like smart ratio because this one is a ratio form. Yes. Maybe the fraction could be maybe one. Like this? Two. Yes. Okay. It's similar, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you see? This one is one to fifty or one to fifty. Similar. So we could add some of the maps they have those things. So I'm going to share you this map so that you can check how these maps have been used. They are both. Yeah, Thank <laughs> you. 